Hello students, welcome to IE. In this video, we are going to discuss a conceptual numerical on the non-uniform doping of semiconductors. So let's get started with the numerical. So in the numerical, you can see it is written that a semiconductor is in thermal equilibrium with linear variation in doping concentration. That means, the semiconductor you pass have, that semiconductor will be having a linear doping variation throughout the distance. मतलब semiconductor के ये अगर semiconductor होते हैं ये वाला suppose this is the semiconductor and suppose this is the length of the semiconductor that is x so along the length the doping concentration will vary linearly so linearly vary करेंगे एकदम either this way or this way in this way so this is the meaning of the first line कि the doping concentration inside the semiconductor will have a linear variation in the doping concentration. So now you can see the second line. Second line ka matlab kya hai? Ki given ndx, jo variation hoga doping concentration ka, that is ndx, that is equals to 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19 into x, where x is the, x is in between 0 to 1 micrometer and t equals to 300k and find the induced electric field at x equals to 0. That means, aapke paas jo semiconductor thay, so if I draw the, this equation, so if I draw the variation of ndx and x, if I draw this, then the variation will be 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19 into x. So, this is x equals to 0. Okay. And x is varying from 0 to 1 micrometer. So, let us assume that this is 1 micrometer. So, at x equals to 0, what will be the value of ndx? We have to put x equals to 0 in this equation. So, nd at x equals to 0 will be 10 to the power 16 only. So, this is 10 to the power 16. Similarly, if I put x equals to 1 in this equation, then what will be the value? 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19. So that means we will get somewhere here value. Let us assume not appropriate value, but the value will be 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19. So the linear variation looks like this. This is the linear variation. It may be Below the origin, negative value bhi ho sakta hai. But I am not considering about the values. I am considering about the nature of the variation. Ab dekho. To yahan pe mera ndx ka value 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19. Yahan pe ndx ka value 10 to the power 16. Aur mujhe bola gaya ki find the induced electric field at x equals to 0. Matlab, ye wale position pe mujhe induced electric field chahiye. Ye wale position pe mujhe induced electric field chahiye. So now, how to find the electric field? So electric field dhunne ke liye, to ye jo mera concept hai, if you remember, this is nothing but the non-uniform doping. Non-uniform doping concept. So in the non-uniform doping concept, always the induced electric field happens. So we have to find the induced electric field at x equals to 0. So in the non-uniform doping, what happens, there will be the drift motion of the carriers as well as there will be diffusion motion of the carriers. So now, in this semiconductor, we will only consider for our assumption that only the electrons are there. Since it is the ND, so we will consider about the electrons. So that is the drift motion of the carriers. What will be the drift motion ke liye kya hoga? Aapka kuch drift current component aayenge. Similarly, diffusion ke liye aapka kuch diffusion component aayega. But the semiconductor is in thermal equilibrium. So, if the semiconductor is in thermal equilibrium, so the net current inside the semiconductor must be zero. So, if it is zero, that is mean the drift component of the current should be equals to the diffusion component of the current. Otherwise, the semiconductor cannot be in the thermal equilibrium. And the, in the question, they have given that the semiconductor is in the thermal equilibrium. That means, we can say that the drift motion of the current plus the diffusion component of the current that is equals to zero. 
So I can say that this I drift plus I diffusion inside the semiconductor should be zero. So what is I drift? So since it is donor doping, so we will consider only electrons. So if we find the I drift, so it can be written as I drift ka value kya hota hai? So it is N into Q U into mu N into E. What is N? N is the electron concentration due to this doping. What is Q? Q is the electronic charge, mu N is the mobility of the electron and elect E is the electric field that is induced. So this is the electric field. So plus another thing, what is I diffusion? I diffusion can be written as Q into dn into dn by dx. These are the well known equation of a semiconductor. What is Q? I have told you that is the electronic charge. dn kya hota hai? dn aapka diffusion coefficient hota hai. And dn by dx kya hota hai? dn by dn dx is the electric jo concentration gradient produced hua hai. That is the concentration gradient dn by dx. Now from this equation I can find the value of capital E. So what will be the capital E? So capital E can be written as you can see I can find the value of capital E. Capital E will be Q E wala agar idhar jayenge to negative sign ho jayega. To negative yaha pe dn yaha pe dn by dx divided by aapka n q mu n. So n q mu n. So this is the value of the electric field that you can see right now. Now we need the value of dn by dx. What is the dn by dx? That is the concentration gradient. So let us find this concentration gradient. So if I want to find the dn by dx. So dn by dx ka value kya hoga? Aapka n jo value honge. Konsa doping kiya gaya hai? Donor doping. So donor doping ke liye we know that the when we will do the donor doping. So nd will be equals to nearly equals to n. So let us put the value of n that is electron concentration jo hoga ohi aapka doping concentration hai. So if I do that so d by dx that will be equals to 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19 into x. So if you do the derivative so what will be so this part will be 0 slip so yaha pe aapka aayega 10 to the power minus 10 to the power 19. So this is the value of dn by dx. So now I will put the value of dn by dx here. Mu n value kya hai? Mu n value aapke paas abhi nahi hai. So let us put the value. So if we put the value that will be capital E. Yaha pe aapka minus sign pehle se tha. Q value yaha pe hai. So Q value, dn value yaha pe hai. So dn yaha pe mera n value. Ab n jo value honge. That is nothing yaha pe mene likha tha ki n is equals to nd. So nd value is this one. So I will put that value here. So n will be 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19 into x. So this is the value of n. Now this is q. So this is q and here it is mu n. A dn by dx ka value kya tha? Minus 10 to the power 19. So yaha pe put kar dijiye minus 10 to the power 19. This minus sign, this minus sign will be cancelled out. Now aapke paas kya hai? Ye wala q hai, dn hai. So I can write a value q honge that q can be cancelled out with this. So here you will have a sleep dn or this is 10 to the power 19. Wala. Now here you will have a 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19 into x. Wala. Or this is a sleep hai aapka mu n. Now if you look at this dn by mu n. If you look at this dn by mu n, what is dn by mu n? If you remember the Einstein relation, so Einstein relation se kya aata hai ki dn by mu n is nothing but kt by q that is equals to vt. So kt by q, what is this? This vt is nothing but the thermal voltage. This is the thermal voltage. And the value of the thermal voltage Vt at P equals to 300K is nothing but 26 millivolt. So 
This dn by mu n is nothing but Vt and Vt value is 26 millivolt at t equals to 300k. So I can put the value of Vt here in place of dn by mu n. So you have the capital E honge, that will be 10 to the power 19. So 10 to the power 19 uske baad, aapka niche aayega, 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19 into x. Uske saath multiply kya hoga? this dn by mu n which is nothing but vt ye mera vt and vt value kya hota hai vt value is 26 millivolt at room temperature now question kya hai ki find the induced electric field at x equals to 0 tab mujhe ye wala e value chahiye at x equals to 0 so what will be the value so e at x equals to 0 can be written as kaise ye 10 to the power 19 hai so 10 to the power 19 यहाँ पे अब नीचे क्या है 10 to the power 16 so 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19 and x value क्या होगा x value is one so x value one मतलब one micrometer one micrometer पे चाहिए at uh, sorry zero micrometer पे चाहिए zero value so यहाँ पे आपका zero आ जाएंगे okay 10 to the power 16 minus 10 to the power 19 into 0 because they have told to find the value at x equals to 0 into vt into vt value kya hoga 26 millivolt so 10 to the power minus 3 millivolt ko maine volt pe convert kar diya ab ye jo 10 to the power 19 hai 0 hai cut out ho jayenge to ultimately aapke paas electric field at x equals to 0 can be written as 10 to the power 19 divided by 10 to the power 16 into 26 into 10 to the power minus 3. So now if you look at this, this 10 to the power 16 ke saath mera 10 to the power third, minus 3 or 19 cut out ho jayenge. To aapke paas jo value aayega that is 26 value aayenge and the unit will be volt per kya aayenge yaha pe minus 10 to the power 3 kya tha. मिलीवोल्ट का वोल्ट हो गया अब ये मुझे 10 टू द वोल्ट पर सेंटीमीटर आएंगे सो दिस इज द वोल्ट पर सेंटीमीटर सो इन दिस वे वी कैन फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ द इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड एट x 0 सो x 0 पे मेरा ये वाला वैल्यू आएंगे सो दिस इज हाउ यू कैन एक्सपेक्ट सम क्वेश्चंस ऑन द नॉन यूनिफॉर्म डोपिंग सो नॉन यूनिफॉर्म डोपिंग यहां पे लीनियर वेरिएशन गिवन था तो ये वाले इक्वेशन को चेंज करके कोई भी क्वेश्चन फ्रेम किया जा सकता है सो so, यहां पे एक्सपोनेंशियल वेरिएशन हो सकता है यहां पे नॉन एक्सपोनेंशियल वेरिएशन लीनियर वेरिएशन कुछ भी डाल सकते हैं बट द कांसेप्ट इज सेम कि आपको अगर इक्विलिब्रियम पे होगा तो आपका आई ड्रिफ्ट प्लस आई डिफ्यूजन हमेशा सेम होंगे सो आई ड्रिफ्ट का इक्वेशन लिखेंगे आई डिफ्यूजन का इक्वेशन लिखेंगे उसके साथ मेरा आई को निकालने होंगे सो so, आई निकालने के बाद जहां पे मेरा इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड निकालने बोला था उस पॉइंट पे x का वैल्यू पुट करके मुझे फाइनल वैल्यू निकालने होंगे सो होपफुली यू हैव एंजॉयड द वीडियो एंड थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग द वीडियो